welcome to Bridge Story Time. My name is Rosa and I am a librarian with LA County Library. Hola y bienvenidos al Tiempo de Cuentos Virtuales. Mi nombre es Rosa y soy una de las bibliotecarias con LA County Library. The books we will be reading today are with the permission of Simon and Schuster and we would like to thank them. Los libros que vamos a leer hoy es con el permiso de Simon and Schuster y les queremos dar las gracias. Are you all ready to get started? I am. Let's start with our opening song. It's Hello, Hello. Vamos a comenzar con esta canción de Hola, Hola. And I'm going to sing the song three times. One time in English so you can hear the words and see the motions. Second time in English so you can follow along. And one more time in Spanish. That is three times. Are you ready? Let's get started. It goes like this. Hello, 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 and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine, and I hope that you are too. Are you ready? Let's do it one more time. Hello, 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 and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine, and I hope that you are too. In Spanish now. Hola, 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 y como estas? Estoy bien, estoy bien, y espero que tú también. All right, that was wonderful. Thank you so much for singing with me. We are now going to read our first book. The title of it is Eustace and Clyde. Nuestro primer libro, el título es Eustace and Clyde. It is written by Marina Aven. And this is our book. It's about two koalas. Este libro es de un par de koalas. Are you ready? Let's introduce them. This is Clyde. This is Eustace. Este es Clyde. Este es Eustace. Can you tell them apart? Their clothes is different, huh? See, sí. and they're also different colors. Son diferentes. No están usando la misma ropa y son de diferente color. Sí, good job. Clyde is no ordinary koala. He doesn't like leaves. He has no time for lazing around on branches and he never sleeps during the day. Clyde no es un Koala cualquiera. No le gustan las hojas. No tiene tiempo para descansar en las ramas. Y nunca duerme durante el día. Eustace is no ordinary koala either. Sometimes he eats too many leaves. Sometimes he loves lazing on branches and sometimes he sleeps all day long. Eustace tampoco no es un koala cualquiera. Mm -mm. A veces come demasiadas hojas. A veces le gusta descansar en las ramas. Y a veces duerme todo el día. Clyde and Eustace share a home. They care about each other very much. Clyde y Eustace comparten una casa. Yes. Y se aprecian mucho uno al otro. Although sharing can be a bit tricky sometimes, why? Why do you think it could be tricky? Look at all the animals in the tree. Look in all the houses. So many places that they're living on on this tree. Aunque compartir puede ser un poco complicado a veces. Estaba preguntando por qué puede ser complicado. Miren, muchos animales viven en este árbol. Okay. See all the animals, ven todos los animales, and all the homes, y todas las casas que están en ese árbol. Clyde 
Clyde and Eustace longed for a place of their own. It wasn't that they disliked company, but sometimes it was better just to be two. Clyde and Eustace desean tener un lugar propio. No es que les disguste la compañía, pero a veces era mejor que solo fueran los dos. A home that is just ours, said Clyde. That's what we need. So Eustace and Clyde set out on a search for the perfect place for a koala pair. Un hogar? Solo nosotros, dijo Clyde, eso es lo que necesitamos. Así que Clyde y Eustace eh, pusieron a buscar el lugar perfecto para un par de koalas. This place is excellent, said Clyde. Um, Clyde. I think it might be taken, replied Eustace. Este lugar es excelente, dijo Clyde. Um, I creo que está ocupado, respondió Eustace. Who, who's occupying the house? ¿Quién ocupa la casa? ¿Quién vive ahí? Un oso, yes, a bear, yes. Job, everyone. Yes, a, a bear lives there. This is so much fun, said Eustace. Oh, I think it is too dangerous, said Clyde. Esto es muy divertido, dijo Eustace. Oh, creo que es peligroso, dijo Clyde. What are they doing? ¿Qué están haciendo? Yes, they're playing on a tree. Están jugando en el árbol con unos monos with some monkeys. Yes. Look, Eustace, this place is huge. But Clyde, I don't think we are welcome here. Mira, Eustace, este lugar es enormous. Pero Clyde, creo que no somos bienvenidos aquí. Clyde, the breeze is so lovely, but Eustace, it is too hot. Clyde, la brisa es tan encantadora, pero Eustace hace demasiado calor. Eustace, we can make snowmen, but Clyde, it's too cold. Eustace, podemos hacer figuras de nieve, pero Clyde hace demasiado frío. Eustace, we have plenty of space. Yes, Clyde, but it is too far away. Eustace, tenemos mucho espacio. Sí, Clyde, pero está tan lejos. Clyde, what a wonderful view. Eustace, it's far too close to the city. Clyde, qué vista tan maravillosa. Eustace, está demasiado cerca a la ciudad. Do you think we might have made a mistake? Said Clyde. Maybe there's nowhere we can just be two, said Eustace. ¿Crees que nos hemos equivocado? Dijo Clyde. Tal vez no hay ningún lugar donde podamos ser solo dos, dijo Eustace. Chirp, squawk, squeak. Although maybe there is one place we could take another look at. Aunque tal vez hay un lugar al que podremos volver a ver. And maybe it's closer than we think. Y quizás está más cerca de lo que pensamos. 
Where do you think they're looking? ¿Dónde creen que están viendo? Where they used to live? ¿Dónde vivían antes? It might be crowded and a bit noisy sometimes, but whenever they have each other, is the perfect place for a koala pair. Puede ser, puede que esté muy lleno y sea un poco ruidoso a veces, pero donde quiera que se encuentren, es un lugar perfecto para un par de koalas. And they look very happy. Y se ven muy felices. And that is the end of our first book. Y ese es el fin de nuestro primer libro. Now we are going to do a little rhyme. Vamos a hacer una rima. And we are going to be puppies that go woof woof. We are going to be kitty cats that say meow meow. We're going to be hamsters that run in place. And we're going to be birds that go tweet tweet. We will be doing this rhyme in Spanish and then we will do it in Spanish. I'm sorry, we'll be doing this rhyme in English and then we will be doing it in Spanish. Are you ready? It goes like this. If you're a puppy and you know, say woof woof, woof woof. If you're a puppy and you know, say woof woof, woof woof. If you're a puppy and you know, it ain't you really want to show. But if you're a puppy and you know, say woof woof, woof woof. Now a kitty, okay? If you're a kitty and you know it, say meow, 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 meow. If you're a kitty and you know it, say meow, 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 meow. If you're a kitty and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're a kitty and you know it, say meow, 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 meow. If you're a hamster and you know it, run in place, run in place. If you're a hamster and you know it, run in place, if you're a hamster and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're a hamster and you know it, run in place, run in place. Good job. If you're a bird and you know it, say tweet, 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 tweet. If you're a bird and you know it, say tweet, 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 tweet. If you're a bird and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you're a bird and you know it, say tweet, 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 tweet. Excellent! Thank you so much for joining me in that. Now, let's do it in Spanish. It's going to be perrito, un perrito woof woof, un gatito, meow, meow, un hamster corriendo al lugar, y un pájaro que dice tweet, tweet, ok? Si eres un perrito y lo sabes, di woof woof, woof, woof. Si eres un perrito y lo sabes, di woof woof. Si eres un perrito y lo sabes, y lo quieres demostrar. Si eres un perrito y lo sabes, di woof woof, woof woof. Si eres un gatito y lo sabes, di miau miau, miau miau. Si eres un gatito y lo sabes, di miau miau, miau miau. Si eres un gatito y lo quieres demostrar. Si eres un gatito y lo sabes, di miau miau, miau miau. Si eres un hamster y lo sabes, corre en lugar, corre en lugar. Si eres un hamster y lo sabes, corre en lugar, corre en lugar. Si eres un hamster y lo sabes y lo quieres demostrar. Si eres un hamster y lo sabes, corre en lugar, corre en lugar, corre, corre, corre. <ríe> si eres un pájaro y lo sabes y tweet, 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 tweet. Si eres un pájaro y lo sabes y tweet, 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 tweet. Si eres un pájaro y lo sabes, lo debes demostrar. Si eres un pájaro y lo sabes, di tweet, 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 tweet. Buen trabajo, excelente. Muchas gracias por acompañarme en hacer esa canción y rima. Thank you so much for joining me in doing that song and rhyme. Now let's turn over to my felt for. This is Dear Zoo by Rod Campbell. This is based on a book. Este, este cuento en nuestro tablero es basado en un libro que es, el título es um, Dear Zoo, escrito por Rod Campbell. And I am going to do it on my board. Y yo voy a hacer esta historia en el tablero. And it goes like this. 
I wrote to the zoo to send me a pet. Yo le escribí al zoológico para que me enviaran una mascota. They sent me in this box right here. They sent them this box. What do you think it is? It says very heavy on the box. Esta caja le mandaron. Es una caja bien grande. Dice muy pesado. What do you think it is? ¿Qué creen que es? Oh, they sent me an elephant. He was too big. I sent him back. Me mandaron un elefante. Ay, no. Era demasiado grande. Lo regresé. So, they sent me a... Le man, so, entonces le mandaron esto, esta caja. It says, fragile. Fragile. What do you think it is? ¿Qué crees que es? So, they sent them a... What is that? ¿Qué es? A giraffe. He was so tall. I sent him back. Así que me mandaron una jirafa. Era demasiado alto. Lo regresé. So, they sent me a... So, entonces me mandaron un... Danger. Peligro. What do you think is in there? What do you think it is? ¿Qué crees que es? Let's check. A lion. So they sent me a lion. He was too fierce. I sent him back. Así que me mandaron un león. Era demasiado bravo. Lo regresé. So they sent me a... So then they sent him this box. Entonces le mandaron esta caja y le mandaron un... It says, with care. Dice, con Cuidado. What do you think it is? ¿Qué creen que es? Let's check. What is that? ¿Qué es eso? A camel. So they sent me a camel. He was too grumpy. So I sent him back. Así que me mandaron un camelo. Era demasiado gruñón. Lo regresé. Oh, no. So no. They didn't return the camel. Regresó el camel. So they sent me a basket. Me mandaron una canasta. What do you think is in it? He was too scary to keep. Era demasiado, era, le daba demasiado miedo. No, lo que, no se quería quedar con él. What do you think it is? ¿Qué creen que es? Let's open the top. Let's get lo, lo de arriba. Oh, oh, what is it? Miren que es. It's a snake. Yes, he was too scary. So I sent him back. Sí, le mandaron un serpiente, pero le daba demasiado miedo. Lo regreso. So they sent him this right here. What is this? It's a brown box. This side up. Le mandaron esta caja. Dice, para este lado arriba. What do you think it is? A monkey. He was too naughty. I sent him back. Así que le mandaron un mono. Era demasiado travieso. Y lo regresó. So, they sent him this box. He was too jumpy. So, he sent him back. What is it? A frog. Así que me mandaron una rana. Saltó mucho. So, lo regresé. So, they thought very hard. And they sent me a another package. So, lo pensaron muy bien y le mandaron otro, otro, otro animal. ¿Quién cree que es? What do you think it is? He was perfect. Era perfecto. Let's see. Let's check. What is it? Oh, look. It's a dog. Es un perro. So, I kept him. Y me quedé con él. Let's name these animals. You want to try? Let's do it in English and then in Spanish. Are you ready? 
elephant, elefante, giraffe, jirafa, lion, leon, camel, camel, monkey, mono, frog, rana, snake, serpiente, dog, perro, wonderful job. You did such a good job naming all those animals. We're going to read another book, and this is Who Am I? Another wonderful guessing um, book to read. And we it is written by Diana um, Leanda. El título es Who Am I? So we're going to be guessing some more. So vamos a tratar de adivinar más con este libro. I purr and play with yarn and string. Meow, meow is what I sing. I am striped or plain or calico. I am a furry sweet. I think it is. Reorando y jugando con hilo y cuerda. Meow, meow is lo que canto. Soy rayado, orizo o calico. Soy un peludo dulce. ¿Qué creen que es? Gato. Gato means cat. I wag my tail, then leap and bark and run with you out in the park. I jump and catch the balls you throw. I am your frisky brown. What do you think it is? Muevo la colita, luego salto y ladro. Y corro contigo en el parque. Salto y atrapo las pelotas que lanzas. Soy tu juguetón marón. Let's check what it is. Perro. Perro means dog. I fly across the sky with ease and build my nest up in the trees. On my wings, bright feathers grow. I am a pretty. Okay, you guys guess. Vuelo por el cielo con facilidad. Y construyo mi nido en los árboles. En mis alas crecen plumas brillantes. Soy un bonito. Let's check what it is. Pájaro. Pájaro means bird. Were you able to guess that? Si lo adivinaron? Good job. In the garden, I will steal all kinds of food to make a meal and nibble softly there alone. I am a hungry gray. Try to guess. En el jardín roba, robaré. Todas las clases de alimentos para hacer una comida. Y comeré tranquilamente a solas. Soy un gris hambriento. What do you think it is? ¿Qué creen que es? Ratón. Ratón means mouse. Did you all guess that one? <laughs> all right. Let's Go on to the next one. I am a, I am furry from head to toes with whiskers on my wiggly nose. I run fast in the rain or snow. I am a lop ear. What do you think it is? Soy peludo de la cabeza a los pies. Con bigotes en la nariz que se mueve. Corro rápido en la lluvia. O en la nieve. Soy un orejudo. Let's check. Conejo. Conejo means rabbit. Yes. I save the nuts I love to eat so I can have a winter treat. Isn't that a smart idea? I am a clever cute. What am I? Try to guess. 
guardo las nueces que me gusta comer para que pueda tener una coloniza de invierno. ¿No es una idea inteligente? ¿Soy una linda inteligente? Ardía. Ardía means squirrel. So we have a gato, which is cat. A perro, a dog. Un pájaro, a bird. Un ratón, a mouse. Un conejo, a rabbit. And una ardilla, a squirrel. That was great. I hope you all enjoyed that. So now let's do a little rhyming game again, okay? Vamos a hacer una rima. And we are going to be tall. So we're going to put our hand up this way. And then we're also going to be a tree with a bunch of leaves. So we're going to put our other hand up this way, okay? And we're going to point to our necks. Show me your necks. Good job. And we're going to point to our legs. Show me your legs. Where are your legs? Great job. And then we're going to run fast. We're going to run in place. We're going to do this in English and then we'll do it in Spanish. Are you ready? Okay. The yellow giraffe is tall as can be. His lunch is a bunch of leaves on a tree. His, he has a very long neck. Show me your neck. And his legs are long too. Show me your legs, your long legs. And he can run faster, faster than his friends in the zoo. Are you running in place? Great job. Now let's do that in Spanish. La jirafa maria es altísima. Su almuerzo es un montón de hojas en el árbol. Chom, chom, chom. Mm. Tiene el cuello, the neck, el cuello, show me your cuello. Muy largo. Y también sus piernas son largas, piernas, legs. Y puede correr más rápido que sus amigos en el zoológico. Run in place, corre en su lugar. Buen trabajo. Good job, everyone. Wonderful. It is time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. We'll sing it three times also. One time in English so you can hear the words and see the movement. The next time we'll sing it in English so we can do it all together and one more time in Spanish. Are you ready? It goes like this. Goodbye friends, goodbye friends. It's time to go, it's time to go. It was nice to be with you, it was nice to be with you. Goodbye, goodbye. One more time in English, here we go. Goodbye friends, goodbye friends. It's time to go, it's time to go. It was nice to be with you, it was nice to be with you. Goodbye, goodbye. Now in Spanish. Adios amigos, adios amigos. Ya me voy, ya me voy. Me dio mucho gusto estar con ustedes. Adiós. Adiós. Esperemos que hayan disfrutado de esta hora de cuentos. Haga clic en el enlace en el cuadro de descripción para realizar una prueba encuesta sobre la programación de la biblioteca y conocer otros programas y servicios. Y no se le olvide suscribir a nuestro canal para acceder fácilmente a nuevos videos. Hasta luego. We hope that you have enjoyed story time. Click the link in the description box to take a brief survey on library programming and to learn about other programs and services. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for easy access to new videos. Bye for now.